Hi, this is Gary at Airfloat. Today we'll be discussing quick and easy flooring fixes for air bearing use. Airfloat air bearings, like all air bearings, require a suitable floor to operate properly. The ideal surface would be smooth, level, flat, and non-porous with low friction characteristics. But what if your floors are less than ideal? Fortunately, there are a number of simple, low-cost fixes available particularly if you'll be performing a one-time or infrequent move. Concrete floors are the most common surface on which air bearings operate. These floors are often made with expansion joints and are subject to cracks. While hairline cracks are generally okay, anything wider or deeper can present a problem. A simple way of overcoming cracks is the use of tape. Thinner tapes, such as a 3-inch wide cellophane packaging tape, or a wide vinyl tape work well. After just a few crossings, however, your tape might get pressed down into the crack. Its effectiveness lessens, and it must be stripped and reapplied. Auto body filler is another alternative. After following the mixing instructions, the filler should be pressed into the crack with a wide putty knife and the excess scraped away. Once the filler is hardened, a flexible disc sander held flat to the floor will quickly smooth the surface without digging in. Expansion joints are another potential problem. They are often wide enough and sufficiently recessed to allow much air to escape out sideways from under the bearing. If at all possible, expansion joints should be avoided in the path of air bearing movement. If unavoidable, the joint can be covered with an overlay. Just about any smooth sheet material works well as an overlay, including sheet steel, plastic, hard-tempered masonite, and non-textured linoleum. Thinner materials less than three one-hundredths of an inch in thickness are easier for air bearings to traverse. Thicker materials may require a ramp up, which can be made by breaking the edge of the material or by making a ramp with tape or another thinner material. Tapes, fillers, and overlays are just a few ways of making a less than ideal floor suitable for air bearing use. For more information, visit airfloat.com, where you'll find our complete flooring guidelines in addition to more temporary fixes. Goodbye.